What's up YouTube, it's Alex Osh, 1234 here from iPhoneExpert.com and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPhone, iPod Touch or iPad using the jailbreakme.com method. This means that all you have to do is go on Safari and type in jailbreakme.com in your browser on your iOS device. So you could be using your iPhone 4, your iPhone 3GS, your iPhone first generation even or your iPod Touch first generation or the iPad and you gotta go on jailbreakme.com we're gonna slide to jailbreak and this is extremely easy it's all done in the browser Comex who is the developer for this jailbreak he found a way to just do it through the browser and it's really really great and you don't have to download anything on your computer and from what I've heard it's a really really excellent jailbreak one of the best that's come out ever so I haven't done it yet, so we're going to do it right now. All you have to do is slide to jailbreak on your device. So go on jailbreakme.com and this comes up and you're going to slide to jailbreak. Downloading. There you see. I'm on my Wi-Fi connection. Alright, so it's almost finished. Sit tight, jailbreaking as you can see. And this gives us Cydia, so that means we can install themes, Winterboard, tons of other applications that Apple does not allow through the App Store, and it's really, really great. And I have tons of other videos that show you how you can utilize Cydia and get tons of great new applications, themes, hacks, mods, all those kind of things, so make sure to check them out. Alright, so to sit tight. Alright, so we finished jailbreaking and it says Cydia has been adding to the home screen. Have fun. It took about two minutes to download and fully jailbreak. We're going to click OK. Now go to the home screen. Let's scroll over. And there we see it, guys. Cydia on our new jailbroken device. As you can see, I am using the brand new iPhone 4. Really awesome device. And you can see Cydia. Now I can install all my favorite apps and themes and all that. So that is extremely easy and it works on all Apple devices using the firmware 3.2.1 or above. All right, thanks for watching everyone. Make sure to subscribe on top and like below. I really appreciate it. Check out my website, iPhoneExpert.com and follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash alexosh1234. Thanks for watching everyone and I really appreciate all the support. Peace out. See ya.